Some things can be made much easier by using a voice command system on your mobile device or tablet. If you have an iOS device, you'll be familiar with the voice control and Siri features. However, you might find them being activated unexpectedly or annoyingly interrupting you when you're trying to do something else on your device. If you want to stop voice control and Siri from popping up on your iOS devices, this video is for you. I'm Jessica from techboomers.com. In this video, I'll be showing you how to turn off voice control and Siri on your iPhone or iPad. Now let's get started. First, I'm going to show you how to fully disable Siri and voice control. In the next section, I'll show you how to make the features inaccessible when your device's screen is locked. To start, open the settings on your device. Scroll down and tap General. On the next screen, select Accessibility. Now, scroll down and tap Home button. Under the Press and Hold to Speak section, tap Off. This will disable both Siri and voice control so they don't pop up if you accidentally hold down your device's home button. Now I'm going to show you how to disable Siri and voice control from turning on when your device's screen is locked. This is a great option if you still want to be able to use these voice command systems but don't want them being activated unintentionally. To do this, you'll need to set up a passcode if you haven't already. I'll quickly show you how to set one up, then get into how to disable Siri and voice control when your screen is locked. Open your device's settings. Then scroll down and tap Touch ID and Passcode. Now enter a passcode you want to use for your device. If you don't want to use a plain four-digit passcode, tap Passcode Options to select another format. Then enter the code you want to use. Once your passcode is set up, you can disable the features you don't want to have access to when your iOS device is locked. Tap the switch beside voice dial so you don't make any calls by accident. Scroll down to the Allow Access When Locked section, then tap the switch beside Siri. We'd also recommend turning off app suggestions from Siri. Tap Settings at the top left to return to the main settings menu. Then select Siri and Search. Scroll down to the Siri Suggestions category. Then tap the switches beside Suggestions in Search and Suggestions in Lookup. Disabling all these features will help keep Siri and voice control from popping up when you don't want them to. Some people seem to find that Siri opens when they're listening to music, especially when working out. To prevent this from happening, be sure to keep your device in a place where it won't get any moisture in the headphone jack. Also ensure that your headphones are properly attached to your device, and that the cable is not frayed at all. Damaged headphones seem to cause problems with Siri and voice control. That's all you need to do to avoid annoying encounters with Siri and voice control on your iOS devices. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, we'd love it if you'd hit the thumbs up button below. Check out techboomers.com for over 100 free courses on all of today's most popular websites and apps.